At new at noon, we're hearing from two women ages 84 and 72 hurt when stray bullets blasted right into their home in Queens. The search is still on for the gunman. Eyewitness News reporter Candace McGowan has the story from Laurelton. The two women who were shot overnight, they're now back at home recovering. They're physically going to be okay, but they're emotionally shaken, wondering who was behind that gunfire. It's 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 84-year-old Mavis Claggett, bandaged and shaken, returning to her Laurelton home that she's felt safe in for nearly 40 years until last night. Gunshot, and then the blood started to run down. When we look over the ceiling, we see four more gunshots. She just walked into the kitchen. Her friend, 72-year-old Beulah Clark, visiting from Jamaica, was right by her side, washing dishes. Shot right through the house. Mm. All in the bedroom, there is shot. Each of the ladies hit by the gunshots. Beulah grazed in the elbow and Mavis grazed in the shoulder. They were panicked, seeing blood everywhere. When me shot, oh God, me almost dead. Police saying the two ladies were innocent bystanders when around 11.30 Wednesday night, gunfire came from a group of people standing on the street at 220 Place and 136th Avenue. The gunfire catching everyone off guard in this normally quiet neighborhood. Uh, boom, 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 boom. And I, and I opened the door and I said, what the hell is going on? I heard a car pass by, you know, you know, and it ran off like, you know. The suspects were gone by the time police arrived. The ladies now left in fear, afraid to return to the house that for decades has been a safe haven. We are innocent. We don't, we, we don't, we are old people. We don't make trouble. So I mean, I know who shot me. We don't have no argument with nobody. A pure old people living at the house. And police, they continue to search for those suspects. Investigators and the ladies, they are both curious about what led up to that gunfire.